today I'm going to be showing you around this 2001 Auto Sleeper Symbol. She's had four owners in its 19 year history. Last owner for two years has changed of circumstances. The owner before him had it for eight years. Yeah, she is lovely. This particular one's got the awning on the side. There's a few extras inside which I'll show you shortly. But just coming around, you can see by the bodywork, she is lovely for the for the age. So we've got the mains hookup facility, we've got the winter cover on the flue for the exhaust for the gas hot water system. We've got the fresh water inlet, fresh water tap. We'll just pop the box. I will show you in further detail shortly when I get the camera back. Just looking quickly under the bonnet. Yes, yeah, so it's the two litre manual. So it's got full service history. It does drive lovely. I've completed a couple of hundred miles in this one myself. There was just a couple of cracks. I've replaced and put a full new set of wheel trims on. All the tyres are lovely. Uh, she was MOT'd recently, so she's MOT'd till February 2021. So, as I say, with the carried out, she's all ready for the next owner. I'll be happy to deliver it anywhere in the United Kingdom. Let's have a quick look inside. So yes, yeah, stepping inside. Well, she is lovely. So as you can see, it's got the front passenger captain swivel seat. It's got a safe underneath there. Lovely all fitted carpets and upholstery as you would expect from a quality auto sleeper conversion lots of paperwork there we'll go through that shortly Let's step inside so yeah so it's the two litre petrol she's covered 48,000 miles in its 20 year history all fully backed up by service history and Bosa online MOT we've got a full bunch of keys no, she drives lovely, this. Our last owner's added a TV cabinet, or a TV in the cabinet, as it were. Uh, it originally has a door here, which the last owner has left conveniently. There it is. So you can put that back to original, or you can try that TV. I've not checked it, I'm not into checking TVs, that's an extra. If it works, it's a bonus. Uh, remote control there for it. And down below, behind, you've got the 12 volt pickup. You've got the aerial and the 240. So yes, I had uh, ST Caravan engineer over here to do another job the other day. So I said, while you're here, can you run through these two symbols that have just arrived in stock? And just give it a good bill of health. It just changed the hose for the regulator gas pipe due to date and the leisure battery it's just had a new leisure battery fitted uh, and she's fine now so she's got a full habitation certificate spotless absolutely this has been looked after by its last owner for sure auto sleepers do tend to uh, be looked after all important kitchen sink three-way fridge so I've got it plugged in now so that has just lit up green that's on mains you've got the 12 volt and you've got the gas for wild camping I will do just a note here I'll on a separate video if you wish to purchase it uh, during completing as remote as possible handovers uh, it's proved quite I'll do a short video, well I'll do a couple of videos demonstrating all the cooker work and all the hobs, all the electric switches, the fridge, the shower, the toilet, basically everything and I can send those to you via WhatsApp and that should make the handover on the day of viewing or delivery. Uh, another oh, last owner's left here, 
Mr. and Mrs. Bowers, and they've left their uh, little uh, cups in. Just one little thing uh, in the Auto Sleeper community for changing these brass buttons and bezels. As we stand now at the middle of Jul June, rather, and uh, Auto Sleeper factory is still on shutdown due to the COVID situation. So I'm running low on these. I will be including a full brand new set. I've got the knobs in stock, so this will be replaced. I'll be including in this sale brand new buttons and brand new rosettes. If the Auto Sleeper factory hasn't opened before viewing or delivery day, what I'll do, I'll just post those on and forward them on. Very straightforward and just unscrew like that. That's for that one. I just push that in, get a little pair of pliers, just unscrew that just gently and it'll just pull out. They are a very good friction fit, no glue needed. Well, that's just auto sleeper all over really. Everything just fits and handmade. So upstairs there, as you can see, large storage area, and that is the large table. So that's the larger of the two tables. The smaller of the one is conveniently fitted in the wardrobe as well as the three infill cushions. So there's the smaller table clipped into its place, rattle three on travel, and there's the three infill cushions. So yes, just looking down on the floor here, so you've got the two places there for the large table legs, one either side, and then there's the other one on the other side. So yeah, you can put them on here, so you can have the large table across here, the large table here or the small table here. Most people choose to have the large table here facing the side sofa and the small table there. But of course, there's uh, no restrictions on what you do. That's what this uh, camping and auto sleepers is all about. You can actually get a bracket. So it's like a tripod for these. And then you, you can get from any accessory store that the Fiorma industry standard. And then you can use one of the tables outside. So yes, you've got the, uh, the bed set up on this symbol is as follows so we've got a lever here just pull this lever down this rear seat folds flat here and that will create a large single bed this as you can see this passenger seat swivels around we just pull that right the way to the dashboard and that'll create the larger of the two singles so well over six foot no problem on this one we just pull the driver's seat in that position straight forward. There's an infill cushion there, and that will also create a single bed. But of course, on here, underneath, there's a little lever. This comes out to the centre. That cushion flops into place behind, and with the little infill cushions, that will create a mammoth queen-size bed. So you've got all options covered there. All matching original halter sleeper upholstery, roof lining. Yeah, she's lovely, this. I'm very happy to put my name to it. We've got the fly nets and blackout nets, as well as, well, the fly nets from the top, the blackouts from the bottom. And then what have we got to show you? Cupboard. For all your workings, so you've got the battery charger there. I'm plugged into the mains now so I can demonstrate. You can heat the hot water on the electricity or you can plug that and that will heat the hot water on gas. You have actually, if you're in a rush, I can't see why you would be in a rush if you're motor roaming, it's not what it's about, but if you're in a rush you can put those both on together and heat the hot water super fast. Extra. So yes, we've got the extra isolator switches for the gas system, so you can individually turn off any supply to an appliance. Cutlery drawer, under sink storage. Showed you in the fridge, but just in case in the freezer department. Wardrobe, which I'll just give you a sneak peek before, but there you go, it's got the three infill cushions, it's got the covers for the outside fridge vents, wardrobe hanger there, you've got the status booster for the TV aerial, cupboard above the wardrobe, extra clothing space I suggest, 
we've got the master control switch very straightforward on and off it's as simple as that a battery test water test and then you've just got one switch for all the lights and one switch for the water pump just walking into the wet room yeah, everything's as it should be Fetford flushable toilet shower tray no rips no tears no cracks to the shower tray just like what we want to see shower and the shower curtain vanity cabinet and drop down kitchen sink hot and cold water so yes uh, we've got the typical of auto sleeper to over engineer things we've got the privacy door so this clips out here and then if the person at the back wants privacy changing you've got that facility clicks it Yes, just close the uh, shower door. So above the wardrobe, which I just, just show you, there's extra space. Oh, it's just for clothing. But extra space above the wardrobe, and below the wardrobe is the Cali gas bottle space. Oh, my stone has left you an extra uh, TV aerial as well as the aerial on the roof. So yeah, you've got both options. So below the passenger rear seat, you've got some pull out cabinets or tray, as it were. So, yeah, the last stoner has left in an extra space. That's not an auto sleeper um, fitting, as it were. This is an extra bit of kitchen top, so that just slides out there and that goes over here to create an extra worktop for the kitchen area. Quite useful, actually. Got the hot water system for heating and that will come out of the vents down below got an extra mains socket there more space underneath the side sofa yeah just all in all it's a very nice example so yes we've got a space here for the two table legs we've got the awning handle and the last owner, 18 months ago, spent £1,800 at Marcus Motorhomes and had these two skylights fitted. It only had a small one. So we wanted the latest Heike 2 large skylight, so that's been fitted. And so is the later Heike small one behind it. So you can get loads of fresh air, where you've got, obviously, lots of uh, natural skylight. It comes with the all-important blackout and we've got the fly net to that side. So yes, nice feature to have. So yes, to recap, auto sleeper symbol, two litre petrol, five speed manual. I'll be happy to deliver this anywhere in the United Kingdom. All they ask is a lift to the nearest train station if I can't get a lift back myself. It's a normal way that we work at Mouster House Campus, just taking a small deposit, which is fully returnable if it's not to your liking. And as I repeat, this will be delivered for viewing anywhere in the United Kingdom, even further by arrangement. It will also have a new service carried out, so the last one was carried out a couple of years ago at 45,000, she's covered 48, so at the very least we'd suggest uh, an oil and filter change to the engine, all the interior appliances have all had a habitation service and signed off by an engineer. Just a quick sneak peek at the front, same as you would expect, auto sleeper quality finishings. Oh, let's have a quick look at the paperwork. So yeah, it's got full service history. There's nine or ten stamps accordingly up to 38,000 then we've got there's an invoice there at full uh, 2017 at 45,000 miles and we've got the habitation serve certificate that has just been carried out for a habitation service and uh, the only thing majorly he said the leisure battery wasn't fully holding its charge so a new leisure battery has been fitted accordingly 
lots of service and paperwork, all the original manuals. We'll just have a look at the driver's side, open the bonnet to have a look at the engine. Full set of keys, 48,000 miles. Lovely armrest to the, all the front seats. So yes, my name's Anthony. You can contact me on 0798 526 1078. Any questions or photographs I haven't picked up on, feel free to ask. One. There's a two fowl. I'll give you a quick sneak peek in this one. This is a 2002 that has just arrived in stock. That'll be getting a check over very shortly. There's the interior, just to see, show you the difference. Well, that will be uh, going on sale shortly. There's an auto sleeper executive just arrived in. That's an Amphist. That'll be going on sale shortly. We've got an auto sleeper duetto that's just recently arrived and what arrived yesterday is the unicorn of the auto sleeper world an auto sleeper vw t4 tdi gatcoom so i'll be on the waiting list for that they come around very rarely at the best of times but in these uh, unique covid times when everyone's wishing to go uh, away locally as it were they'll be hard pressed to find one so yes Thanks for watching, folks.